Good afternoon folks, Joe Spock from MDB Aviation. Hope you guys are doing well and having some good times flying and simming. Today I want to show you how to install the plugin for running the SciTech radio panel, multi-panel, switch panel, and enunciator panel in X-Plane 10. So as you can see here, we got all the panels in a quick image from xplane.org from the Sparker upload. So let me downsize this. What you're going to need for all this is warn. Make sure you already have X-Plane 10 installed on your computer. Make sure you have a downloads folder, or at least know where your downloads are going once you download them from the internet. And go to xplane.org, create a user profile, search for SciTech, and you're going to click on the X SciTech Panels plugin. It's going to be a download. It's made for Linux, Windows, and Mac, 32-bit and 64-bit. Once you have that open, you'll see some notes. Make sure to read through them for anything that may have changed between now and whenever you download it. And know that depending on which version you're running, you're going to be downloading a different version. Which version of X-Plane you're running, you'll download a different version of this plugin. So we're going to be downloading version 2.35 for X-Plane 10.3 plus. So click download and it's going to give you some options. It'll be either panels 1.46 which is for an older version of X-Plane. We're going to want x SciTech panels 2.35. So go ahead and click download and depending on your internet connection this could take anything from a couple seconds to a minute. Ours is currently downloading. While that's downloading, I'm going to go ahead and open up all of our folders. So, X-Plane folder, Downloads folder. While that's finishing up, I'm going to come over here to X-Plane. Within the X-Plane 10 folder, go to Resources, then Plugins. Within here, I already have the SciTech Panels plugin installed, but I'm going to go ahead and overwrite that with the latest one. So I'm going to come back over to Downloads click on the download itself then I'm going to go ahead and extract all extract now let's go ahead and open this up you have a lot of choices in here there are different configuration files samples there's work for changing up for different add-on aircraft depending on what aircraft you're using there are some conflicts for certain add-ons so do know that there are notes out there there are people that have come up with their own special configurations but basic config is it does exactly as it's stated so let's go ahead and take this X SciTech panels and all we're gonna do is drag and drop I'm gonna replace this one so move and replace all yep and that's all you have to do for X-Plane 10 to get your SciTech panels to work Enjoy the video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave comments below. Enjoy the simulation time and flying time. Have a good day. Joe Spock from NDB Aviation. Bye-bye.